Hi, I'm Dr. Kargada Sandeep and I practice at Center of Homeopathy in Bangalore. Allergy and asthma do often occur together many a times and they have a lot more in common apart from just making you uncomfortable. Well, the same substances which cause allergy such as pet dander, exposure to dust, exposure to uh, pollen can also induce asthma symptoms in a person. Asthma can also be brought about by certain uh, food allergies and skin allergies. Uh, this all contributes to allergic-induced asthma or allergic asthma. In asthma, the airways of the lung, they become narrow and they swell up, producing excess mucus. This can lead to difficulty in breathing, it leads to shortness of breath. It can also trigger a cough and wheeze. Though allergic asthma is very common, asthma can also be caused because of a number of other reasons. It can be induced by exercise, by physical activity. It can be induced by exposure to cold. It is also not uncommon to find it uh, getting triggered because of stress. Allergies, on the other hand, are a number of conditions which can arise due to hypersensitivity of your immune system to, again, the harmless substances that we mentioned earlier, including dust, pollen and uh, pet dander. Allergy symptoms can include hay fever, it can include atopic dermatitis, it can include uh, certain uh, gastric uh, allergies and uh, most commonly we see symptoms of uh, redness of the eyes with irritation, we see runny nose, we see uh, sneezing. So uh, there's a lot which is common uh, between asthma and allergy and at the same time it doesn't mean that every episode of asthma is because of an allergy. To watch more videos of me, please subscribe to Dr. Circle.